Pizza Flix presents Classic Movie Monday. The Cisco Kid is a fictional character created by O. Henry for his short story, The Caballero's Way, first published in 1907. Four actors portrayed this Western hero in 25 films during the sound era. In 1928, the first all-talking Western starred Warner Baxter as the Cisco Kid, followed by Cesar Romero, Duncan Ronaldo, and Gilbert Rowland. And we are in very dangerous pieces. We must work quick. These guns he labeled to bark many, many times. But he is the best friend I got. Ah, next to you, my friend. Yes. Let's go to work, huh? Thank you. 
them up. For the love of St. Patrick, what's this? Everybody come out of the court. Oh, there you are. Oh. Now, hold up, and look if we get away with our lives. Uh, All right, get the gun on him. Keep him out, Claude. Come on, North Trip. Draw down the gun. Now, throw down the gold box. Bill, get the feet out of the way here before we get shot. All right, here it is. Here it comes. Gracias. They must. Keep the hands up. Oh, I think I'm going to faint. You do, you'll fall on your ear. The pretty lady. Come here. Who? Me? Uh, no, the other pretty lady. Oh, for pity's sake. <laughs> Come here. Everybody get back in the court. You have nothing to fear. Boys, I was held up down here at the devil's pincushion by that Cisco kid. And I sure 
sure would have killed that fellow too if my gun hadn't have hung with my bill. You saw he would have. Where was the colonel at? He's inside. Go and see him, Charlie. Say, there's got to be something done here about this Cisco kid. He held up my stagecoach down here and took my Wells Fargo box. He didn't harm or rob any of my passengers, but he liked to scare all of them to death. Hmm. Where'd you see him? I met him down here off in the desert, what they call the Devil's Pin Cushion. Oh, hardly. Now, Sergeant Dunn, report to me at once. Yes, sir. I'll tell you the fact, what I'd have done. If my gun hadn't hung on me, I'd have, I'd have shot him myself. Yes, I know, Charlie. I know just how you feel about things like that. Am I fated? Sure. Come on, sweetheart. One pass for Papa. One that's all, I'll shoot the white. Read him and grieve. Ha! That's my baby. Rich and ricey, nice and spicy. All right, come on. Play me. Cover that smart, you guys. It's a nigger better, but... I see where President McKinley is going to send a bunch of you boys down to Cuba. Yeah, so I understand. Come on, sweetheart. Come on. My Brooklyn baby needs new shoes. Ha! Oh. Dynamite! Another natural for big casino. Hey, what's the idea? Did you walk to a pasture or something? Come on, long hair. Hudson! Hudson! Get out of my life, hard luck. Come on, Ada from Decatur across the equator. Ha! It's a fool. Hey, listen, bad news. If I never see you again, it'll be soon enough for me. Jeez. But the colonel wants you. Well, why didn't you say so? That's different. Tom, hey, Papa, what's the Tom, hey, Papa, 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 Tom, Papa, 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 what do you want me to do? Cry? Sure. Hey, can you imagine? It's just because he's got stripes, he thinks he's a zebra. I never saw a guy like that. Come I've got a great idea. You do the playing, I'll do the interrupting. And we'll split. Are you trying to make a dishonest soldier out of me? Honest. Well, holy God. Boy, I'm going to have you fixed by then. <laughs> <laughs> Sergeant Dunn will play for duty, sir. Sergeant, the Kisco kid's back in our territory. He just held up the stage coming in from the south. It's up to our outfit to get him. I want you to take a squad of men and go in the wolf country, camp at the Frio and work west. Yes, sir. And don't get the idea that this is any picnic. This is not the usual type of cattle rustler. He's smart and he's brave and he's a killer. And you don't need to worry about any court martial if you shoot first and argue afterwards. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Then get going. Yes. Holly, thanks very much for the information. You bring him back dead or alive. Well, I'm darn glad of that, and I'll bring you over a picnic. <laughs> Somebody? 
You heard me. I kill him too. First, I try to get my eighty-seven dollars back. Uh, you lose eighty-seven dollars, my friend. That is too bad. I hate to see working man lose so much money. Uh, this Cisco kid, he's very bad egg, I guess, huh? He's bad, all right, and plenty dangerous, too. You say the gals are all crazy about him. <laughs> That's funny. Funny? <laughs> I don't know. He may be very handsome. Probably just a dirty grazer. Oh, you have never seen him, no? No, but we're going to. Come on, Joe. Let's get this vigilante committee started. We'll make this town safe anyway. Yes, we'll get Cameron Randolph and turn in the rest of the gang. We'll round them up before the night is over. It took me, it took us a month to set that $87. And now it's all gone. My friend, up in the hills, I have fine much gold. Ha, I tell you what I do. Your fish for me, nice that. With nice sweet sauce. Nice new tower. And then when I go away, I make up to you all the money you lose. <laughs> Gracias, senor. You are very kind. Uh, you. That's enough. No more customers today. Only you. Now I fix a, a finer dog. <laughs> That's right, my uh, friend. I have my girl to the city, and I sent my girl to the town, and my girl is still young and sweet. Just a minute. Come in, my friend. Are you the barber? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I'm the victim. Oh. <laughs> well, what's the idea of locking the door? <laughs> He's barber fellow. Uh, I don't know, but he's much scared bandit. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, you tell him he don't have to worry from now on. Oh, that is good news. <laughs> from now on, everybody should not be afraid. <laughs> I'm glad you come. Yeah. Uh, you got nice big gun, too, huh? Yeah, well, that ain't no captain. So you're carrying. No, uh, no this is... Hey, Giuseppe. No, no, no more costuma. Costuma? What do I look like, a dressmaker? Yeah. Oh, dress... <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> hey, Giuseppe, business is business now. You take care of this gentleman. Yeah. Uh, you are next. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Giuseppe. I take my bath now. Oh, hey, you got any more perfume? No, no, no. Oh, excuse me. Maybe you use perfume, huh? For my women, nothing but jockey club. For me, next. <laughs> well, for me, you see, I go around so many different kinds of people, I, I got to protect myself. <laughs> <laughs> well, now, for nice good hot bath. Yeah, well, don't burn yourself, Father Roy. Well, you definitely you got my bath all ready. Everything uh, very nice. Soap, towel, brush, everything enough. Yeah, that's fine. I say, uh, scrub your back. <laughs> oh, no. I'm too ticklish. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hey, Paulie, hurry up. 
Oh, take care of my soldier, friend. Give him anything he wants. Yes, senor. Anything you say. Anything you say. By golly. This is luxury. Ra 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 boom the eye. Ra 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 boom the eye. Ra 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 boom You drop the this? Ra ra ra. Yeah. You? Me and the bell of Greenpoint. Say, she's got more in a minute than Lillian Russell has in an hour. My, she's just too skin. Too skin? Listen, she has more curves than a scenic railway. <laughs> I like them fast. Fat dames are old-fashioned, old-fashioned. Just the same, I like them fast, sir. All right, all right, Garibaldi, you can have them fast. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that gent in there? He's a nice fellow. He's a bigger gold than silver men from the eel. Oh. Say, listen, do you happen to know anything about a fellow they call the Cisco Kid? I understand he drops into this town occasionally. I'm very anxious to see him. Do you know him? I understand to my girl. Do I know about him? Say, I'd like to miss him just a while. And that's what we've been now. Just a while. Well, meet him with that, and not me, Chief. <laughs> he's a got a nice voice, that fellow. And she's ready to nice? <laughs> he must have promised you a big tip, Chief. <laughs> Want a shampoo? No. Want a singer? Singer. Say, what do you think grows in my dome? Ten feathers? Want a tonica? No tonica. Shave it. Hey, Pop. Where's the sergeant? He just went on up to the barber shop. The barber shop. <laughs> what for? <laughs> Wait till he sees the gals in this town. <laughs> Why, the old connoisseur is liable to voice right out crying. <laughs> Tell hey. some powder and witch hazel. <laughs> he only has to smell sweet, doesn't he? <laughs> What's the matter with the gals in this town? Come. No, no sissy stuff. <laughs> Getting dolled up, eh? Well, we've been all over town, Sergeant. You won't like it here. No? Why not? Well, all the dames we've seen is fat. Yeah, there ain't a skinny ankle in town. Just a lot of old, broken-down war horses. The sun's bleached them. Yeah, the sun and peroxide. Say, don't they make any pretty goyles anymore? Say, listen, you roughneck. Get down to business and cut out the dames, see? Oh, there ain't no better business than dames. Get back to camp now, Pronto, understand? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, what did I think of this? I don't see why I'm You're the bigger boss, huh? That's right, you know. This little frontier town of ours will soon be a thriving, prosperous city of the great Southwest. The railroad is coming in down here, and it's up to us to suppress the bandits the outlaw and the desperado. If the sheriff can't do it, and the army won't do it, then it's up to us to drive them out of here. Now, boys, there's a proper spirit right there. Well, now I feel very good. 
How you feel, Sergeant? All right. Oh, excuse me. Hey, I forgot to introduce myself. Uh, my name is Juntalo Sebastian Rodrigo Don Juan Chiquello. <laughs> uh, but the girls, they call me Conejito. That means little rabbit. <laughs> oh, little rabbit, huh? Are you that fast? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> well, my name is Mickey Dunn, and the girls call me Big Casino. Meet me. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> what do I owe you, Garibaldi? Oh, no, no, never mind. No, this is my tree, son. Oh, fine, sure, fine. I pay. <laughs> well, my friend, I give you $100. That make up all the money you lose. <laughs> Poor fellow. Somebody steal his money. Mm -hmm. I got no juice for that kind of thief. You're right. I'd like to get my hands on him. Adios, my friend. Goodbye. Got your horse? Uh, this is my horse. <laughs> yeah, he's a fine-looking animal. Uh, this Valayaki uh, he's the best friend I ever got. Yeah. What do you say, my friend? I meet you down to the saloon at, uh, well, at 3 o'clock, huh? 3 o'clock? Yeah. Right. What are you going to do in the meanwhile? Call on the senoritas? <laughs> No, no. Only one for me. Oh, I like lots of senoritas, but I love only one. Same with me. One at a time. It's only fair to the sex. Know what I mean? <laughs> huh? Adios, my friend. So long, little rabbit. <laughs> 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 well, I'll be blowed. <laughs> Little rabbit. Come on, my friend. Well, if it ain't the old village blacksmith himself. Hello, Sergeant. <coughs> Hello there, <coughs> little rat. <coughs> well, Pop, did you give the old boy a new pair of patent leather shoes? Well. Yeah. All around. He's ready and waiting for you. Cost you 80 cents. Good. Good morning, Mr. Higgins. Good morning, Matilda. Good morning, Matilda. Say, you know any people around these parts? Well, I reckon I know almost everyone. You know a fellow they call the Cisco Kid? <laughs> Say, that was him you just shook hands with over there. What? I just, I just shook hands with him. Sure, that was the Cisco Kid himself. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'll be... Well, what do you want, eh? El conejito is coming. He's here. 
Maria. It's a Quran right oh, now. Mother did you. Hold him there. Keep him there. Hurry, oh, come hurry. On. Come out. Come out. What's the matter? Go, oh, get out quick. Why? Don't want to make talk. My lover, he's coming. He killed you. Quick. What kind of greeting is this? You stand there as though I was the devil himself. Si, si. Welcome home, my very good friend. <laughs> Gracias. Where is Sonia Maria? I tell her she come. <laughs> now I must go feed my horse. Yeah. Who will feed me? I'm hungry. Get me ham and egg. Si, si. Plenty of eggs, eh? Si. What's the matter with you? Uh, you cannot move? I must give you start, huh? No, no, senor. But that old woman is getting crazy. He does not suspect? No, but someday he will catch you. Then what? You will have a flower in your hand, but you will not smell it. Then all your troubles will be over. So will you. Yes. Conejito! Conejito! <laughs> Inflate, papa, que ya te pelarán. Así paga el diablo quien bien lo sirve. Eh, my Tonya. Oh, my Conejito. <laughs> hey, you always come to meet me. What's the matter? What you been doing, eh? Never mind that. Where's you got that face with? You been with other women, eh? No, oh, no, no. Don't tell me that. <laughs> My Tonya. Pero qué tonto que te vas a matar tú solo, Dios mío. Bye, Kalyan. 
I'm dry. You got something for drink? I got you some nice cool vino, eh? <laughs> see, <laughs> see. Lots of vino. And ham and eggs. <laughs> well, nobody he can cook ham and eggs like you. See, see, ham and eggs? <laughs> Uh, we keep this door locked while I'm here, do you understand? Yes, sir. Mm. Mm, that smells good. I love that. Uh, you, are, you are pretty as ever. <laughs> <laughs> no matter how old they get, they never lose hope. <laughs> Don't you say it's pretty? <laughs> Joe, my favorite. Only Joe. Here is your vino. But Joe, my flower of love. That eats the butt. <laughs> Make sure warm, eh? I don't need anything to make me warm. From here. I could squeeze it to pieces. I'm crazy for you. Why not? I am lovely. Lovely. All the day and the night when I ride over the desert sands, you are always in my mind. In the wind, your rippling laughter. And in the night, your sad, sweet smile among the stars. I count the hours till I can come back and hold you in my arms again. His words were damn beautiful for that old woman to hear. <laughs> yeah, come here. Listen, go down to the saloon. Find out how many soldiers or sheriffs there are in these neighborhoods. Uh, also, find out how many is look for me, see? You keep the eyes and the ears open, but the mouth closed. Not have to Yeah. Right now, this is a very dangerous place for me. No, no, sabes to be in. Yeah. Gracias, conejito. Gracias. Yeah. Hey. Okay. No cognac. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, now, what was I saying to you? You were telling me how beautiful I am. <laughs> I don't got the words enough. <laughs> Probably you get the idea that I love you. <laughs> Something is burning. You bet your life. Something is burning. The ham and eggs. Sonia Maria. How? What you want? Hey, you're better than the whiskey. You're better than the whiskey. 
to do when I am gone, eh? Uh, I think I take a little nap. I ride all night, no sleep, no rest, and plenty dangerous. <laughs> Everybody look for the Cisco kid and nobody catch him. <laughs> the Cisco kid, very smart fellow. <laughs> Come on, you must hurry now. Where's your locked door? I locked him. Goodbye. Uh, uh, now for a good sleep. Elenita, Elenita, ¿quieres hacer el favor de cuidarme, mi baby? Yes, I'll take care of him. It is no trouble yeah. for me at all. Gracias. Eres muy amable. Te lo agradezco mucho, ¿eh? Yeah. Oh, Dios, 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 Dios. Why, golly, whose baby is he? Ah, uh, senora, come here. Where's Chicuelo? Yo no entiendo lo que me quieren decir. Yo no sé lo que están ustedes preguntando. Yo no entiendo. I don't speak English. No, no speak English. You can't get anything out of these coyotes. He's heading for there soon, and and there's where we'll get him. Come on. Hello, sweetheart. Did you buy your mama a drink? <laughs> and then mama had enough, eh? Please, one drink. Coochie, coochie. Oh, you keep Hello, sweetheart. I want a drink. You want a drink? Yes. Hey, boss, have it. Well, this Roger glass is here, will you? Well, I want it, eggs, no one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give it. Thank you, love. How do you know it's for me? This message is for the handsomest man in town. Well, you're on the right street, so just speak up. Senor Chiquelo, the man to meet this morning is called out of town. Oh, that's so. Well, well. This name is terrible rough place for nice gal to come. Oh, it is? These women are very bad. No. Women are very common. <laughs> you wouldn't fool me. No, I wouldn't fool you. <laughs> I hate to see a nice soldier like you get mixed up with bad women. Well, girlie, I'm glad you warned me. Come on, sit down, have a drink. You speak to me? Yeah. What you try and do? Make fun of me, eh? Let me tell you this. I am the prettiest girl in town. Well, what am I supposed to do now? Drop dead? <laughs> you are a conceited fool. Yeah, well, you're no shrinking violet, baby. <laughs> you can't understand any man not falling in love with you, huh? Well, what is the matter with me? Turn around, let's see. <laughs> you think my favors are cheap, eh? You think I might be another green, eh? How do you know what I think? I don't care what you think. Well, that makes everything square, baby. Maybe I'm not like these other men, either. Maybe you are saint. A soldier saint, eh? <laughs> not he's <even> funny. <laughs> the last soldier who come to this town was carried out on a stretcher. Well, you still got that stretcher. <laughs> a soldier saint. That is funny. 
that's as funny as a cry for help. <laughs> She has come from San Luis Obispo. Uh, my father. <laughs> He's a terrible smart man. Uh, uh, with my mother. Beautiful like a rose. I run away from Portugal when I was this big. <laughs> I never see them no more. Now, well, I'm sorry. You are very mysterious. Mysterious? Life is full of mysterious. Yesterday and tomorrow, the rainbows end and the moon beams beating. Who knows? All the time, your life is in danger. My life? <laughs> what is my life, after all? The warm breath of a few summers and the cold chill of a few winters and then I got it. I think I need a drink, huh? Elenita, take care of the TV. I come for my baby. This your baby? <laughs> I go bring him, her. I bring it to you right away. Gracias, señor. How much you take for him in gold? Pero que se ha creído usted que yo le voy a vender a mi hijo por todo el oro del mundo, no lo vendo. Ah, she says she only got seven others. <laughs> she cannot mm. part with this fellow. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, look at him. <laughs> oh, he is so sweet. The most precious things in the world cannot be bought with gold. <laughs> the tender touch of a little baby's fingers. The light in the woman's eyes and the love in a woman's heart. That... Maybe yeah, you better take him, huh? Where the devil is this Tonya Maria? Yeah. Uh, kiss my horse, Brando. Your sister told you? Yeah, he's smart, Alex. Step on himself. I hate that kind of man. You make eyes at him? Oh, you hurt my feelings. Ah, well, I am sorry. Ah, you go away so soon? I must go to work. <laughs> Come on, hold out the hand. Si. <laughs> Plenty of gold for me and the morada. Gracias. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that is why I like to work so hard. So I can buy pretty things for my gal. Where did you go this time? I know where uh, there is lots of cattle on the Guadalupe. Soon I get rich. <laughs> then we go far across the sea to Portugal. Hmm. Yeah, that is beautiful place, Portugal. Nowhere is the sea so blue like the sky. Nowhere is the rose so red and nowhere is the south wind so soft. First, you got to remember I see this place when I was a kid. <laughs> Every place looked good to kids. Maybe I not like Portugal. Maybe I not be happy there. Ah, then we go wherever you want. 
But first, you got to be happy always. That is what I say to myself. When you come back? Huh? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I come back very quick. <laughs> Sometimes in my business, <laughs> I have to go places very quick. <laughs> well, goodbye, my sweetheart. <sighs> I always like to see you wave to me when I ride away. <laughs> goodbye, my sweetheart. Goodbye. You bring me something? I always bring you something when I come back. Here, goodbye. I don't know see you. Adios. Adios, my conejito. My conejito. What you down? Well, finally you got a kiss, eh? That should last you the rest of your life. Say, this is funny. What you think men like, huh? Big fat cow? I think men like a big, our poor woman. You, you so small, take a three or four of you to give man appetite. You're crazy. I got any man I want. Just now, Janet Colori, a soldier, he threw himself at my feet. An American soldier, an officer, a general he was. He looked at me and he said, Dios, what a beautiful figure that, that girl he's got. I would walk over broken glass in my bare feet for just one of her kisses. That's what he said. He must have been broke. <laughs> drunk? Yes, he was drunk with love. <laughs> he said to me, if you do not let me love you, I will kill myself. Well, you're not going to let me kill myself, are you, baby? <laughs> I am so sorry. We were just playing a little game. Won't you come in? Will I? Can a duck swim, huh? <laughs> Who's the old girl? Uh, that is my cook. Cook? Is she up on Irish too? We will excuse you. Cook! Just feel what next? <laughs> <laughs> he is very bashful. You don't mind? Not at all, not at all. Well, finally you'll change your mind, Mr. Soldier. When I'm wrong, baby, I admit it. <laughs> yeah, you should. You were very bad to me in Toulon. I'm sorry. No gent can say more. <laughs> well, of course, I was a little fish myself. I know that. <laughs> yeah, I should say you were. But big-hearted Mike, forgive you. <laughs> maybe, maybe you would like to come in the house. Eh? I see. Well, I'm practically in. Well, be a hot time in the old town. Pobre Sonia, I get you some nice cool vino, eh? Ready? Yes, ma'am. Please. Put a little red ink in front of the old stars, and they'll begin to chat like Laura Jean Libby. You, you come this way often? Often? Say, I'm already running for office in this town. I would like to know if you got a girl. Sister, I've been a hermit all my life. It's made me just a little bit. Oh, you should not feel this way. You should... Be cheerful. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Baby, I see where I'm going to be putty in your hands in no time. You like some dinner, eh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, <I do. laughs> so, Joe. 
my exposure. To you, muchacho. Nice, eh? Yeah, that and the caress of a mule. You like me to uh, tell your fortune, eh? Yeah, sister. If that's in the system, give me the voice. <laughs> hey, oh. my soldier, huh? <laughs> well. <laughs> Hey, that's my traveling bag. <laughs> now I tell you fortune, eh? Are you good at it, baby? Huh? Good. Anything I tell you, you can't believe. Yeah. <laughs> ah, look. The first one, you are lucky. Yeah. I think you've seen us shoot another natural. That is a very beautiful girl coming <laughs> into your life. Beautiful face, the most beautiful eyes, her teeth, she is a dream, and what a figura. Figura? Yeah, she got a shape just like Venice. Venice? That's in Italy, isn't it? You are going to fall madly in love with her. Going to? Come here. <laughs> Tell me, uh, you make much money, eh? Enough for two, and maybe three. Hmm? You like to look ahead, don't you? You are very romantic. Yeah, well, you ain't doing so bad yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, baby. I'm going to be transferred next month to Governor's Island. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Where is that? Back to civilization. New York, right at your front door, Chief. <laughs> oh, I'd like to see it. You take me there. Sister, that's the idea that's been gallivanting through my mind this very minute. You and me in New York together. Say you love it. Oh, New York. Gee. Why, in New York, you can get a glass of beer that high for a nickel. Oh, nice, too. <laughs> and the Bowery. Baby, you ain't seen nothing till you see the Bowery. Finest street in the world. Saloons and dance halls everywhere. Hmm. Free lunch. All you can eat for nothing. And the finest whiskey, ten cents a throw. You can pour it yourself. They got pretty clothes for girls, Daddy. Clothes? <laughs> Baby, you can get the swellest pair of shoes in the world there for two dollars. And hats. Well, you can get a hat for a dollar and a quarter with a feather that long. And petticoats. Oh, <laughs> Baby, why do you see the petticoats? Every color under the sun. <laughs> girls show them on rainy days. Oh. Rainy day. That's when you see the sight. <laughs> Hot tomato. <laughs> oh, I would love to see it. Yeah? You and me together. Is it a go? Hmm? Yes, it is a go. Let's fill with a kiss. One for big casino. Hmm?
Maybe we do him just say me not. I am ready. Yeah. Oh, uh, don't you want to leave a note for, uh, somebody? Why did you say this? Well, I thought the old woman might worry. Oh, let her worry. I hope she worries the rest of her life. The old cat. <laughs> Come on, baby. Are there uh, nice soldiers in the camp, eh? Huh? Yeah, perfectly nice. There'll be a hot That's the Cisco kid, all right. What do you reckon he's going to get for them steers? About 4,000? Five thousand on his head and four thousand in his pocket. That's nine thousand for us. Right. All we gotta do is to trail him in the hills and give him both barrels in the back. Why, it's the easiest money we ever got. <laughs> Now he's heading through to Coyote Wells. Now come on. Let's take to the pass. Andy! 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 Well, this is the place. Now let's wait for him up in the bluff. Thank you for the money, my friend. Goodbye. Good luck. Ben, have you ever seen that fellow before? No, I don't believe that I ever have. Well, take a good look at him, because you'll never see him again. Those three cattle rustlers have been waiting for him. And two to one, they'll get him. Beat them to it. Bring them down the first chance you've got. There he is. Give it to him, Mark. Now, ta-da, the bar. 
No, no, not the brewery, the Bowery. <laughs> Go on, baby, now. The Bowery, the Bowery. They say such things and they do such things on the Bowery. The Bowery. I don't think I'd go there some more. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine, baby. Sweetheart, you got a voice like a Brooklyn sparrow. <laughs> Gotta give you credit, son. You sure can pick them. <laughs> <laughs> Love and duty. For once they go together. How do you mean together? You fellas know where we come up here. Well, oh, sure. Hey, listen. Mm-hmm. Now, this gal used to belong to the Cisco Kid, see? But when I came into her life, things changed. <laughs> Cut that out. Ambuchero. Ambuchero. Mickey. Mickey. Yeah? What do you want, sweetheart? Come here. Oh, practically there. What's on your mind, sister? Now I know why you come to my house. You come there looking for someone. That's right, baby. I was looking for you. Not the first time. The first time to come looking for a man, a bandit. How do you know? I am not blind. Here is a peasant offering what? reward for him. A big reward. Is that the reason you make love to me? To get the man and the money? <laughs> no, 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 no. That is a lie. You are a thief. I hope he kills you. Hey, baby. No, they talk it. No, they kill No, they kill Hey, wait a minute, sister. As you come to the level with this gal. Oh, he ain't. He plays them all. You serious this time? This morning, he asked me if I knew anything about buying furniture on the installment plan. No. He wanted to know how much it would cost to furnish a flat in Flatbush. <laughs> Say, don't let that fool you. Six weeks lets him out with any gal. Say, listen, he buys wedding rings like you and me buy bananas. That is, if we bought bananas. How much is this reward? $5,000. Say. You didn't think I was figuring on any part of that, did you? What do you mean? Why, I was going to turn the whole amount over to you. Oh, I did not know I did. Yeah. $5,000 all for me? Why, certainly. I'll get a promotion out of this. <laughs> and a gal, huh? That's enough for me, baby. You get the money, all of it. Five thousand dollars. All the things I could buy with these. The others. Yeah. <laughs> hey, the sergeant's framing a nice surprise on the stand. Only going to take his life and his gal. That's all. He ain't out of it yet. Don't worry, don't worry. He's the best shot in the army. Well, he'll have to be, if what I hear of this Cisco kid is true. Yeah? Uh, when do you expect a Cisco kid to come back? Son, Guadalupe is not very far. Yes, he will be back soon. Maybe you better take me home, eh? I tell you this. You will never recapture him. Alive. Yeah? 
Well, I ain't figuring on capturing them alive. Uh-huh. $9,000. I'll be rich. Rich. Come on, we're going to eh? All right, lady. Maybe you got better man to you than these, huh? This is the best one I got. This is very rare. He come from Sorville. Yeah? Yeah. How much you take for him? One hundred dollars in gold. That is fine. I buy him. <laughs> By golly, you know I ride many miles just to find you. Yeah. Yeah. I say to myself, eh, I cannot go home. Unless I bring something nice for me and the Marauder. Uh-huh. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I can see her in this now. Beautiful night angel. Mm. Adios. 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 Adios, Amigo. Adios. Adios. Soldier in the house. Well, baby, that's what I call a perfect evening. Pardon me. My love, no one but you, my soul. I'm a piece of food. <laughs> I never, never loved you. I swear to you. Listen, my love. He will come back soon. He will kill you on sight. You must not let him find you here. He is a bitch. I wish you were dead. You must kill him. He told me he would never be captured alive. He is desperate. Oh, I wish you were dead. Will I get this reward money soon? <laughs> Sure you will. Just as soon as I identify him. I will send you a note by the old woman when he returns. Maybe, maybe tonight, about ten o'clock. My love. Hello, my muchacha. Ten o'clock. Yaki, my friend, you remember I told you I was great ladies, man. <laughs> that does not go now. I am not as good as I think I am. 
And maybe I never was. Honey Island, Brooklyn, the Borders, five thousand dollars. And my gal to the town. And my gal, she's young and she's pretty. And she's ready to settle down. Oh, oh, my lover. I was afraid something might have happened to you. I was afraid you might not come back. I would not disappoint you. <laughs> I know how anxious you have been for me to come back. Sonia, tell me, have there been anybody here looking for me today? Oh, no, no. No? No. Sonia Maria, this law is closing in around me. Tonight I am sure that this, this life I live, he does not say, but, but like the man who is caught in the, in the whirl, whirlpool, I cannot get out. That is what a thief comes to know. He cannot rub out his past. Uh, he may be able to get away from these people who hunt for him, but he can never get away from himself. I go on, Tonya, till this chapter here is finished, but uh, I know in the end I will pay. Tonya, we will go far away tonight together, huh? To Portugal, ah, Tonya, I try. I try to start all over again just for you. Ah, oh, that will be grand. <laughs> but I cannot get ready tonight. Tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes, my nana. Well, you get ready for a long, long journey. Get me wine. Get me vino. I'll get you wine and food, eh? Yes. Yes. I put my horse in Karaz. Where'd you been? At the market. In the wagon? Sure, in the wagon. Listen, take this note to Claudia. Ride in the wagon to his camp. You know where he is? Party quick, it is very important. Don't make talk. I explain to you when you get back. Here, quick. Hey, hey. The old
Say, listen. Why don't you fellas change the bill of fare once in a while? Beans, beans, beans. General Grant said, let us have peace. What a memory that boy has got. Eggs. Why don't you get some eggs? Say, do you know that eggs cost 15 cents a dozen? You have to buy them. Well, what do you want me to do, lay them? <laughs> you can't do that. Or soldier. Sí, con ejército. Men are found, Tonya Maria. You can get any man you want. I did not tell you I was Toyoma. You got something for me? <laughs> the surprise of your life. your eyes with their warm devotion, and to your lips with their warm kisses, and to the heart of you and all the other girls in the world who, <laughs> who are true, I dream. To you, my brave caballero, the bravest of the brave, my love. <laughs> Sorry, Sonia. The wine was so strong, it, it makes me cough. <laughs> <laughs> it don't make me cough. <laughs> the old woman. Hey, listen, you better be careful, Sarge. You know, you're liable to get in some trouble. Now, listen, you fellas, keep quiet. No funny business, now, you understand? Oh, I didn't say anything. Who is the old woman? Ah, she lives with the gal. Well, he better look out for them foreigners. They do things different. <laughs> Gracias, Sonora. I guess I know who it's from. He is here, but he is going away tonight. He is frightened. He thinks the posse knows his hiding place. When he goes, he will be disguised as a goyle. He will wear my clothes and on his head a large white mantilla. I will wear his clothes and ride away. Come at 10 o'clock tonight. Do not fail. Shoot quick and straight. A hundred kisses, Tonya Maria. Hey, here's something else. Remember, he will wear a large white mantilla. You will be able to see it from a distance. You get the idea, boys? The bandit's going to try to escape tonight in a girl's clothes. Well, it is empty. You 
you have more? No, no. no. I have had enough. The job's finished, boys. I get my man tonight. Get him alone. You better let us go with you, Sarge. No, sir. I've got a particular reason for wanting to toy this trick all by myself. So long, boys. The old Sarge has got a new gal, and she's a pepper. Hey, we ought to go along with him anyway. Nah, nah. Didn't I tell you he was the best shot in the army? Oh. I think it is getting dangerous for me to stay here. I better go. I send for you. Adio. No, no. You must not go. You must not. I will not let you. I will not let you. You must stay here tonight. I am afraid to be here alone. Tomorrow you can go. But I will not let you go tonight. Such anxiety he is touching. <laughs> you are so beautiful. I could not refuse you anything. <laughs> uh, we should have gone to Portugal tonight. I better look around outside to make sure there is no danger. Somebody is out there. Adios. My beautiful angel, that is what you are and what you will be, an angel. When I ride away, you stand outside where I can see you and wave goodbye to me. And I know you love me. If it is to be the end, I want to know that you are thinking only of me. My beautiful angel. On pursuit. So wave to me when I ride away. Has it? Ready to settle down. <laughs> 